Hey everyone, Ryan from Me Bike Escape, and in this video, we're checking out a new type of accessory that until now I have not had experience with, and that is a portable air inflator. This one is made by a company called Psych Plus, C Y C P L U S, and they reached out to me, offered to send me one, and since I have not used a portable air inflator like this, I said absolutely, I'd love to check it out. And so in this video, we're going to talk about this air inflator. I'm going to pump up a whole bunch of electric bike tires and I'll tell you what I think. If you are looking to purchase this product, please check out the link in the description as that helps support the channel. I will also have links to our electric bike accessories list, our top e-bike brands page, and finally our e-bike discounts code page. With that, let's check out the Psych Plus Portable Air Inflator. All right, here is everything that comes with the Psych Plus A7. You have the inflator. This is a skinnier one that is a little bit longer. Dimensions are 40 by 50 by 233 millimeters. I'll put inches on the screen so you get an idea of how big this is. These types of inflators come in various sizes. We have a removable hose, which of course is nice if you are bringing this with you on a bike ride. And then we have three connectors here. We have a needle, which of course is good for basketballs, volleyballs, those types of things. We have a Presta adapter. I'll be testing this out in this video as well. And then we have a general hose that you might want to use to pump up perhaps an inflatable mattress or something like that. Now this air inflator can go up to 150 PSI apparently. It also has a USB-C charger, so this is a rechargeable air inflator. And with the battery capacity, the company says it can inflate three car tires or 12 bicycle tires or up to 40 basketballs with one full charge. So we'll be putting that to the test, inflating a few tires here in the garage. And the company says this will take three minutes to pump up a bike tire from flat. So we'll certainly be putting that to the test. Of course, that's going to vary on pressure as well as how big the tube is in the tire. All right, next I wanna show you how this attaches and I'll also show you the LED display. So to attach the hose, you simply screw it into the top. And then you have a power button here on the center and it does have presets for various functions. So bike tire, 45 PSI, looks like a scooter, 2.4 bar, car tire, 2.5 and a basketball 8 PSI. But what I've found is the easiest thing to do is just set your PSI to whatever bike tire you're pumping up because this can vary quite a bit. So we'll show you that here in just a second. You also have a charge indicator and the plus and minus buttons will increase or decrease your PSI or if you're using bar, you can go over to the other preset setting and change it up or down. It also has a front light on the front, as you can see here, which is a handy addition. All right, let's pump up some tires. All right, let's go ahead and release some air from our Radwagon 4. All right, that bike tire is plenty flat. Okay, I'm gonna go ahead and put the inflator on, make sure the hose is nice and tight, both on the inflator itself as well as on the tire. Go ahead and power it on. Set it to 30 PSI. We typically run our rad wagon a little bit less when it comes to tire pressure, so it continues to fit in our Hollywood rack. I'm gonna go ahead and start a stopwatch and we'll see how long this takes. Okay, next we're going to take some air out of my wife's road bike and we're going to see how it works both with Presta valves as well as high pressure. All right, we're going to go ahead and put that Presta cap on, see how this works. And I probably don't talk about these bike racks enough, but I did a review last year. Really love these bike racks, not only for our electric bikes, but also our 
road and mountain bikes. They're made by a company called Steady Rack. All right, so with this one, we'll go up to 90 PSI or so, and you can hold it in and it'll go a little bit faster for you. All right, and I will set a timer for this one as well. All right, here we go. Air is going in much faster given that there's less air volume. It's already up to 18, 20 PSI. We're at 75 and about one minute and 20 seconds in. All right, one minute and 40 seconds for that road tire, not too bad. So what is my take on the Psych Plus A7? I think this is a great accessory. A portable inflator is a great idea. I think if, especially if you're going out on trails, I see us using this a lot at home because one of the nice things is you can just turn it on the bike, turn it on that Schrader or Presta valve, turn it on and you don't have to worry about it. That's something that is going to be a lot easier getting your bikes ready to go if you're going for a ride. And one of the challenges with some bike pumps and this is the reason I recommend high quality bike pumps, is sometimes it's tricky to get the bike pump on properly on that Schrader valve or on that Presta valve. Now I pumped up a tire on our Rad Wagon and I also did one tire on our Aerial Rider D-Class and then I did one tire on my wife's road bike and at the end I pumped up two tires to 40 PSI on our GT Power Performer. Now for a vast majority of use cases that's going to be plenty of power, plenty of air to go into those tires and of course this assumes that your tire is completely flat and after I was done testing pumping up those tires I did notice that the battery indicator was going on so I assume it was getting a little bit low on power but still that was five bike tires and again a couple of those with lots of air. As far as downsides of a pump like this obviously this is going to take up some space when you're on your electric bike so you definitely want to make sure you have some room in a front bag or perhaps some panniers and I think the other thing is to just keep in mind you will definitely want to keep this charged it will come in handy but you want to make sure when you're done using it charge it up so you don't have any issues when you're out exploring so definitely check out a portable air inflator I know psych plus sells multiple models this is again the a7 but of course there are many companies that sell portable pumps such as this one, but this one will definitely be going on our recommended electric bike accessories list. Thanks for checking out this video. I hope you found it helpful. Again, relevant links will be in the description. Thanks for watching and we'll see you in the next one.